your place and think they have a chance, all of a sudden they come out in the second half trying to look good. Well, one who's been looking very good is Jay Strait, senior guard with 13, uh, make that uh, 16 points tonight. That was a great block by Channing. Nothing defiant. Just go straight up, let the ball touch your hand, make the block good. Shakur. Channing, this is for two points. Nailed it. Oh, that's a good little start for Channing Fry. A block the defensive end, come down, knock down the 18 footer. It's time for a CF to step forward. Take hold of that hole, the paint area, down low. Be a presence. You sound very convincing. You've done that. Straight moves it over to the corner. In and out. Fry with the rebound. Channing with three boards to go along with six points. Salim Stoudemire in the first half had 13 points. Too much dribbling. Oh, no, way too hard. Not, not only was the pass hard, he tried to put spin on it trying to get cute. That's a tough one to hold on to. A little bit earlier, watch how Channing just puts the right hand straight up, not swooping down at it, try, not trying to knock it out of the gym, and got the rebound off it. Then he squares up, one foot behind the three, one of them on the line. Nice couple minutes here for Channing Fry, except for that pass. He had a good roll going. Arizona with a 10-point lead, its biggest lead of the game. 47-37 just to start the second point. Straight can change all that. A rare miss for him tonight. You heard Lute Olsen at the end of the first half say the scouting report on Straight was that he's a driver, a slasher. He's been lighting it up from three all night tonight. Cowboys get on the scoreboard. Here in the second half, Adams with the basketball for Arizona. It's Channing Fry. Fry with the left-handed hook and good. All right, Channing. Bring it. Bring it to second half. You know, one of the things I talked to Josh Pastner about, Wyoming, because Josh did the scouting report. He said they got a lot of sides. And yeah, but Josh got Channing. And Channing Williams step will, up. Yep. And Justin Williams would love to have that opportunity again. Went straight over the head of Alex Dunn, who was wide open. That would have been an easy two. Dave, one thing Arizona has not done well this year is when somebody's hot to go back to that guy. Channing Fry has stepped up again in the second half. Go back to Channing. He's down low. He's asking for the ball. Too much dribbling going on. There you go. Shoot Stoudemire right goes to Fry. Fry is fouled as he shoots. He will go to the free throw line. That's the move. When you're a big man, you're down at a low block, and they're sending two and three people at you. They're coming from out on the floor. You catch it, you turn to the baseline side, you shoot the jump hook. The only thing they can do is foul you. It's either foul or go to the line. Channing has scored four points here in the second half, eight overall with three rebounds. And he makes the free throw. Take a look at Channing through the start of the season, Bob. Slow up and then back down again. Well, you know, he's had a tough time this year. There's no doubt about it. I mean, the things like this, you know, three rebounds, no way. If you're 6'11", you are not supposed to end up with three rebounds in the game. By with a pair of free throws, he's having quite a second half now. Six points in the second half, Arizona. 51-39, 12 points, their biggest lead. Washington in and eighth in the I thought so. Move both of the feet. Arizona a chance to extend the lead. Here's Isaiah Fox from just inside the arc. He nails it. Arizona's big men shooting well from outside to start the second half. In case you join us, Ivan Rodinovich started the game. He's got a bruised hip, so Isaiah Fox starts the second half. Down Hassan Adams, fade, fall away. Hassan looked and saw five foot ten Jay straight in front of him. He said, unless he picks up a charge, he cannot stop me from shooting this basketball. So Hassan kind of slid to the right a little bit to avoid the charge and put off the glass and in. Arizona on a 10-0 run. And now they've got three cats in double-digit scoring. Robinson takes it outside to strip again. Jay looking for a way to penetrate. Very difficult. Stoudemire with good defense. 
would not let him in. Threw up the shot up the one hand, doesn't fall. Adams alone, no three, but a whistle and a foul underneath. And it's on the Cowboys. This lineup right here to start the second half is clicking. It's gelling. The biggest difference is you've got Fox at the power forward instead of Redenovich. So McClellan in, Isaiah out. So Hassan Adams will move to that four slot. Stoudemire inbounds the ball. This is the other lineup I wanted to see. I wanted to see McClellan and Hassan Adams in the game together. Cowboys better throw a lasso around Stoudemire in Arizona now because the Wildcats have now come out on fire. Some would say in fuego. In fuego. Well, that ends that halftime speech in Wyoming about feeling good. Yeah. <laughs> but see, this what you're supposed to do. The first five minutes, set the tone. Well, the Cowboys got off to a shaky start in the first half as well and just whittled it down against Arizona. So we'll see if they do that again. Wabington goes to the basket and is fouled. And he will go to the free throw line. We'll take a timeout at McHale Center. Salim Stoudemire and the Wildcats coming out on fire here this second half. Staff League, well, the sports list is the show that counts down the 10 best and worst of everything in sports. Five nights a week. The sports list with host Summer Sanders. Weeknights at 5, only on FSN Arizona. Well, the Wildcats off to that great start in the second half, and Channing Fry right in the middle of it. You know, a nice block and a rebound. This time he squares up, shoots the 19-footer. A little left-handed hook, a little quick move. Channing brought it the first five minutes. Doubled his output from the first half. Look at that, six points and two rebounds. First half he had four points and one rebound. All that in five minutes. The young man has the ability. He just seems almost like a person running in sand. And with the made free throw, Todd. Well, guys, an update on Ivan Radinovich. Uh, as he came out with the Wildcats at halftime for their warm-ups before the start of the second half, he did not take part in those warm-ups. The official word is he will not be back in the second half with that bruised hip. He's already moved his way all the way down to the end of the Wildcat bench. We'll send it back to you. Derek Wabington with a pair of free throws and the Cowboys back with it 17 of Arizona. Boy, my goodness. Cats with this uh, great start here in the second half and without Ivan Radinovich, as Todd just described. And we hope he has time to repair. But that'll also give Arizona some more minutes from others, exactly like Ken Guerra, who's in the ballgame now for the Wildcats. Fly with the miss. New faces in the lineup, including Mohamed Tangara. And a foul. Thank you. Good chance for the to get some minutes from Tangara. They're going to need his size. I mean, the young man has got a great body on him for a freshman. 6'9", 240 pounds. He hasn't really even filled out yet. But he's got to get some experience. When we played in high school and come over from Mali, West Africa, the young man just didn't have that much of basketball knowledge. The only way to really get it is in practice, but then you have to get a chance to show it from practice into the game. He can rebound, though. He will go after the glass. We've seen that in practice. Williams with the jumper for Wyoming, by the way, 58-43 now. Baseline, baseline. Under 15 to go. Shakur is fouled by straight, and he will go to the line. Chris Rogers gets set to check in for Arizona. He's still, what's fascinating about Mustafa, excuse me, not Mustafa, but Mohamed Tangera, is just a culture shock still coming from where he's been and what he's done in his life. In his very young life. Yeah, some guys like Chicago and Detroit thought he sounds a little different. Chuck <laughs> coming from Mali, West Africa. By the way, the Cowboys have a player from Africa as well, Bien Benu Sangando. He's from Bangui, Central African Republic. Interesting to know if they spoke the same language. Shakur 
from downtown.